welcome to my 2021 uh, autumn home tour. Uh, this is starting off in my kitchen, in my little corner cupboard. Uh, this is how I've decorated this year with just some popular array and some cones and things like that. And obviously a photo of Tiki. Um, this is over in one of my little corners in my kitchen. This candle, Ross actually got me not too long ago and it's lovely. Um, I've also burnt through a lot of that warm candle, warm apple cinnamon one as well. So I need to buy some more of that. <laughs> This was a wreath I actually made myself. Um, I think I got the wreathing for like a pound or two pound and got all the um, leaves from Amazon and I sewed them on. This was also in one of my recent um, videos. This is from Amazon, this was 10 pound. I think this looks really, really cute here. I really love this. I just think it really like makes my kitchen look super autumnal when you walk in, it's quite striking. So love that. And then, oh this, oh my God, Ross's mum actually bought us this for, um, with some other Halloween sort of autumn presents as well. And I put in a little frame from, I think it's from Poundland, but it kind of just perfectly completes my little hot chocolate station. So thanks so much, Julie, for that. And also, obviously you've got to have flakes on your hot chocolate station, that is a must. Then over to my candles. These are all from Home Sense, like all of my candles are. Um, I don't usually burn all three of them at the same time, but I was feeling fancy this day. So you got all three there. Then moving over to the kitchen table, this is another candle from Home Sense. This is a DW Home one and a Home Sense wreath. You may see a very common theme here. My house consists of everything from Home Sense. Um, these are some little pumpkins actually come in a flower arrangement years and years ago. Um, I'm just zooming in here on my chocolate pretzel cookies, which I made the other day. But admittedly, they weren't my favourite cookies that I've ever made. I was a bit gutted with them. I put too much chocolate in them, but. Anyway, they were still still something nice to have. Oh, this is when Tiki come in to see me. Um, yeah, these are my shelves. And Ross's mum got me this as well from Etsy. It's like meant to look like loads of um, autumnal books. So again, thanks Julie for that. <laughs> She's really kitted me out with autumn things this year. Um, so yeah, just thought I'd make that look super homely and cosy. Then over here is a cushion cover that I got from Amazon. This was, um, I think this was 99p, I think. I've literally just put a cushion in that doesn't fit at all, so don't mind that, that's why it looks a bit rubbish. Um, but I also got my footstool up from um, last year, if you remember that. This is actually an aquarium ornament that I use as a normal ornament. I think that we got that years and years ago, I think. We've got a couple of ones like that. This is just the the reef that i well not the reef i've actually made this myself i'll show you it better with the light on in a second this is in our hallway as you come in the front door and um, this is it with the lights on so you can actually see um, this acorn again is from home sense um all of these bits and pieces in this bowl are from amazon as well um they oh my god there was loads of them and then i've just put a candle inside which has burnt through and made all the glass dirty so I need to sort that out and then this little guy I think was from Poundland I actually spray painted him white and he needs to be spray painted again because I didn't do a very good job um, these oh my god one of these uh, the one on the left hand side Ross's mum got me again from Etsy it's like a woolen pumpkin it's absolutely gorgeous and the other one again is from home sets these are just in our front room on the windowsill which Tiki is not happy about she does not like them there and then onto the little coffee table again that is from home sense and this candle i found in my um in my shed from last year which i thought was such a touch so yeah managed to get that out which i think was from tesco's actually um and then lastly this is a little cushion again that i got from amazon i think this was 99p as well for this cushion cover again the cushion does not fit properly inside but we're not judging here it's just one that i had on the sofa and i just squashed it up to fit inside the cushion cover um this is sticky being super cute and actually wanting to come and sit with us which was lovely um, it's quite funny actually I think she thought there was something behind the cushion because I lifted it up so like for ages she was sitting there trying to figure out what exactly was going on um, but yeah that, that was quite cute um, but yeah that cushion cover I think was again like 99p it come from America I think it come from America it come from China um, so yeah super super cheap it just says happy fall y'all um, which I think is like such a Hobby Lobby thing to get if you ever go to Hobby Lobby in the states not that i've ever been but i've watched a million hauls from hobby lobby um yeah this is really cute russell's playing with her behind the cushion she was very confused she gets very confused anyway thanks for watching see you soon bye thanks for watching